Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Music Marketing TV. I'm Dan D, and thanks for tuning in. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to set up Sidechain in Pro Tools with Dynamics Modeler and Gain 3 from Blue Cat Audio. Alright, so let's get on with it. I've already placed my plugins on my source and my output. So I have it on my kick. I have the Dynamics Model on my kick. And I have the free gain, stereo gain on my guitar. So this is just a volume knob. And this is a whole bunch of stuff. Gate, expander, compressor, limiter, you name it. All right, so let's show you how to set this up. First thing you're going to do is go to the menu here. Go to global settings, MIDI output and you're going to take total gain 1 and 2 and you're going to select a number here uh, I'm going to select 2 and 2 for both of them then you have to hit enable MIDI okay good to go with that one let's go to the gain do the same thing global settings control out uh, control input enable MIDI 2 and 2 All right. Now that you've uh, set that up, you're going to have to open up a MIDI track. Uh, I'm just going to press Control Shift N, select a MIDI track, and bam. I already have one, but I might as well show you from start, from scratch. So you're going to go to your input output section here, and your output, you're going to select Blue Cat's Dynamic Stereo Out, right? And you're going to select, you can select all channels, it doesn't matter. Um, or you can go straight to two if you're doing something more complex with uh, the dynamics modeler right then you're gonna go to the input of gain three right and you're just gonna hit select hit and select two right because uh, that's what we did for this section here two and two and bam so this is not gonna work unless you hit the arm button on the MIDI track okay that is very important if that's not on this doesn't work. Let me let me show you. All right, <laughs> all right. So we go to our dynamics modeler, mess around, take off the auto gain, dry, hunt uh, zero percent. Okay, make sure it's fully dry so you don't affect your kick. And you can see it's not doing anything. But as soon as I hit arm, there we go. So that's pretty much it for this episode of Music Marketing TV, showing you guys how to sidechain in Pro Tools because it's different than most DAWs. Make sure you set your input and output correctly, arm the track, mess around with your settings, and bam. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace!